This now is how God's children are living. This is 90-year-old Ghana, and her story is hard to even hear. When I was young, the Nazis came to our village, and I was escaping them, and one of them noticed me. So the Nazi hit the horse, and the horse jumped on me and broke my bones. People who watched it, they did not believe I will survive it, but I did. She's a Holocaust survivor who's lived an isolated life, and now she still is alone. During the winter time, I feel all the pains because my very poverty diet. No vitamins and no protein, so my legs and hands are very weak. These survivors for their entire lives have been just that, survivors. But today, during this Passover holiday, let's make sure that we bring them just a little bit of hope, a little bit of comfort, by bringing them a little bit of food. <laughs> I'm so grateful to you to bringing uh, this food product. This is what I will eat for the next month with your help. I can't imagine me having to do that. No one was there to help me. No one was there to provide for me. But through the Fellowship of Christians and Jews, we are going in and feeding her and helping her the best we can. Become a part of the fellowship today by reaching out to bless these precious people of God. You will bring God's blessings into your life as foretold in the scriptures. Matthew chapter 25 verse 40, Jesus says, If you've done it unto the least of these, my brothers, then you've done it unto me. The least of these, my brethren, is talking about the Jewish people, those who are hurting, feeding, clothing, saving Jewish lives. If you will bless that people, the hand of God is extended towards you. For just $25, you can help supply the essential foods they desperately need for one month. That's less than a dollar a day. Or for $50, you can help provide three hot meals a week for an entire month in addition to the food box. The meals will not only nourish them physically, but will bring healing to their souls when your fellowship angel comes three times each week to deliver the hot meals. When fellowship finds these Holocaust survivors like Lilia, it's often that they're cold, they're sick, they're weak, on their final days without anything in their home. I speak to so many people who say that they pray for the Holocaust survivors. When I come here and I sit with Lily, I realize prayers are important, but what she needs right now is food. These forgotten survivors were on the last days, weeks, months of their life. We've prayed for them for years, and now it's time for us to act. When people respond to this program, we're able to rush an emergency survival food box. But she's bedridden. What she needs is a hot meal. And I'm just praying that someone who sees this program will look at Lilia and feel led in their heart to respond. What she needs is three hot meals a week. She doesn't have time to wait. She's counting on us for food, and she's counting on us for her survival. Living on extremely meager low pensions of $2 a day, they go without food, medicine, and the bare essentials for life. But through the fellowship, you can change that. Just $25 will help provide a survival food box packed full of important staples for their diet, 
It includes everything they need to celebrate the miracle of the Passover holiday. Or for $50, you can help provide three hot meals a week for a month in addition to the food box. Without your response, their painful suffering and deprivation will continue. If God is leading you to do more, join our Box a Month Club and you can help provide ongoing life-saving aid to an elderly Jew in need for just $25 a month. When you join, you will begin receiving this beautiful Promises of a Prophet scripture set for display in your home. Yael adds a special devotional teaching to each, and we ask that you please remember to pray for the elderly Jews you are helping each month. We brought you this program so that you could see with your own eyes what the needs are. God tells us to take care of them, to feed the hungry, to clothe the naked, to shelter the poor. And I pray that through you, through me, through our efforts, through this fellowship, so many more Holocaust survivors elderly who are on their last ounce of hope will be restored, will be renewed, will be given the basic needs that they so desperately pray for to survive. The preceding was a paid presentation by the International Fellowship of Christians and Jews. Here in the middle of the street because I have something that I want to show you. Two and a half hours down that way, there's a Holocaust survivor waiting for food. And two hours that way is another Holocaust survivor waiting for food. It is a big mission to get them both food and meet the needs of all these Holocaust survivors all over. But if God says that it's important to comfort them, then that's important to us. 